What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Elizabeth. This is EJ Joyful Plans and in today's video we are flipping through a new sticker book from Casthetic Plans and I am going to decorate my horizontal planner for the week. So let's let's talk about it. Here is Casthetic Plans newest sticker book. It's called Winter Time and this was sent to me by Cassie to share with you guys. So it was sent to me full disclosure. And I have not flipped through this yet. You're getting our first impressions for real, for real today. Pardon the packaging noise and the birds. I have the windows open right now just to get some fresh air, which means you're going to hear some grackles and you're going to hear my dog barking probably. Okay. Winter time. Wintertime sticker book. So here's some stats, some, oh boy, information about this sticker book. This is a 40 sheet sticker book. I think 40 or was it 50? I think it's 40. No, I think it's 50. Oh crap. Now I can't remember. Oh, it's a big sticker book, you guys. Maybe we'll count the pages or I'll just leave it in the description box. I think it's 40. I think it's 40 pages. No, 50, 40. I don't remember. Let me grab um, seasonal scenes. What? Oh, you know what? Duh. 50. It says it on the back. So if you ever have a moment um, like I just had, check the back. 50 sheets, you guys. This is a big wintertime sticker book. And because it is 50 sheets instead of 30, it's going to cost $34 plus shipping. I will leave my affiliate link down below. So if you decide to shop, I would love if you used my um, my link. So let's get into it. We've got our winter time up at the top. This releases, did I already say when this really, y'all, I am a, I am a hot mess today. This sticker book releases on Tuesday. No, excuse. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Can I restart this video? I'm not going to restart it. Should I restart? We're going to go with it and we're not going to edit. This book releases, rewind, this 50 sheet sticker book will be $34 and it releases on Monday, December 4th at 10 a.m. Central Time. Ooh, that was so hard for me. I don't know why, because life is hard. Let me take a swig of water. These are hard times we are living in. Um, I hope that you guys had a wonderful, wonderful Thanksgiving season. And now we're starting to get into when. Oh my goodness. We're going to have a lot of interruptions today. I can just feel it. Okay, winter time. So we're through the Thanksgiving. Can, can you guys? That actually doesn't sound like a grackle. Grackles are worse shockingly. Okay. You know, if you know, you know, if you live in Texas. Okay. Let's get into winter time and nearing the holiday Christmas season. These are paper stickers. Love the colors. She just always nails it. Like I feel like Cassie's aesthetic is my aesthetic. I'm going to back up just a little bit so I don't have to keep moving the sheets back and forth. Okay. So First sheet is paper, beautiful neutrals. Love it already. And what I always love about Cassie's books is how thoughtfully designed they are. So this first sheet is on paper and then you get the same designs, but in clear. So you have both a paper and a clear option. And the clear is always gonna look a little different than the paper because color just picks up differently on clear paper versus the paper paper. Okay, so next we have all kinds of pretty little icons that match the vibes. These are great individual elements to create scenes. You guys already know this is the perfect aesthetic, excuse me, water, perfect aesthetic to pair with script washi and grid washi. You're gonna see a million people using these stickers with grid and script washi and they're all going to look beautiful absolutely beautiful here's that same sheet in clear Ooh, now we've got some of them starting to group together so this is one big sticker 
So Cassie always gives us a sampling of individual pieces and then the whole kit and caboodle with them clustered together so you can see what they look like. Man, I was gonna do my um, my horizontal faith layout for the week, but some of these might be too Christmassy. <gasps> oh, yes, 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 yes. Give me these clear, alcoholy, glittery, but not, <coughs> but not sparkly. Um, stickers all day every day air day <gasps> and she's giving us to those in giving us two of those in clear excellent call Cassie I don't know if I would have loved a clear and a paper in this version I like that this is this this type of design does really well on clear so glad she gave us two of those in clear and then here are the boxes that go with that whole first set so we have the deco, we had the kind of splotches, we have the boxes, bullets, and then she's going to give it to us all combined with these clusters. <gasps> Stop it, you guys. Okay, who here has not gotten on the Casthetic Plans train yet? Is anybody willing to leave a comment? And let me know. Have you been missing out? Um, I'm telling you, don't miss out. These sticker books are so good. I love the individual elements and then the clusters for ideas and for just quick planning. How beautiful. Lovely. Oh my gosh. Look at these florals with these pearls. These are paper. And then here it is, clear. Oh my gosh, so pretty. So pretty. Here it is, uh, a new sheet with paper. And with clear. Now I need to reconsider what I want to decorate today. Oh, so pretty. So here we see what they look like with some boxes. But some of them have a little bit of color. I don't know if y'all can see. But these have just a hint of like ice blue, icy blue. That one's uh, like an oval. And then we've got some squares. So pretty. Oh, so pretty. Two sheets of those. Mm. Oh, you guys, these are clear, just ink glitter blotches. Oh man, I am a feeling this. Two sheets of those. Then we have our, ooh, I like, ooh, I like what she did here. So this blotch kind of has a little bit of pink to it. And then look how these look with these three colored boxes. Look how they kind of, see how it kind of like gives a little, a little wink and a nod to that pink. Ooh. That was a good color call, very good color call. And then here we can see what they would look like clustered together, those kind of icy blue stickers with a box and some of that um, alcohol ink over it or under it. So cool. And these are just pre-made clusters for planning on the go. You get two sheets of those. Oh my gosh. How beautiful. I love lined art with like just the spray of color that doesn't stay in the lines. Oh, it's so cool. Really cool. This is definitely a Christmas nod with the candy canes, like Santa's sack, lollipop, a candle so pretty these are clear these are all clear oh you guys I can't handle it <sighs> I'm flipping through this um at the end of November truth be told and I just want to do all the December spreads right now oh my goodness so pretty uh and then here they are combined 
so pretty. And then our boxes that go with that collection. It's just so original. And here we can see them all kind of clustered together. Mm, 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 mm. So pretty. Love, love these clusters. Ugh, these colors, you guys. Here's our next collection. So pretty with the poinsettias. This is like lined gold illustrations. And it looks like it could be glittery, but it's not. Ugh, here it is on clear. That is beautiful. Our next sheet on paper. Here it is on clear. Oh my goodness. Paper, boxes and frames, wreaths, very pretty. Second sheet of those on paper. Mm. Alcohol ink in Christmassy colors. Ah! I love the spray of gold on top. You just get in there. Can you guys see that? Oh, I can't handle it. I can't handle it. And yet I can. I'm still here. I'm still here. Two sheets of those. Beautiful, rich Christmassy boxes. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. So good. Here are the pre-made clusters for us. Beautiful. What? Yes! Mm. It's a wig of water. Yay! Okay, what sticker book? She did this once before in a sticker book. These are full sheet. This is a full sticker. This whole thing is a sticker. So you can cut out a design if you want, or you can rip it like scrapbook paper, and it's got the adhesive on the back. Oh my gosh. Yes, 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 yes. Oh my gosh. Joy to the world. Ah! Oh my gosh. I wouldn't even want to rip this one. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I love this. Oh my gosh. I just want to use it now. So do you guys get, get what I said with this? That this whole sheet is one giant sticker printed on it. So you can rip it up like paper and it's got the adhesive on the back and just do scraps. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm trying to figure out how, what would be my strategy with ripping. Mm, I'd probably take this whole sheet off and rip, rip it up. Like rip this up, have this be separate and then have like se sections. Oh my gosh, that is gorgeous. This, if you're looking in this and going, how would I have room in my planner to actually plan if I'm using a sticker like this? And the answer is, this is great for memory keeping. Really great for memory keeping. And you know, if you've got a week um, in December that is less busy than others, like throw some extra decor down but I think for memory keeping this would be really beautiful like a December um journal oh my goodness so pretty then we have Ooh, has she done has she given us quotes before I'm flipping through another sticker book right now of hers um seasonal scenes are there quotes in seasonal scenes another good sticker book um no this might be the first time we have quotes i love the mix of uh cursive and and sans serif very pretty I'm trying to save my voice so i'm not going to read are these different hold on two sheets of the same clear quotes and that is winter time oh my gosh you guys well, now I want to do. Now I want to do a Christmassy, wintry spread. Oh my gosh. What do I do? And what planner do I plan in or decorate? This is tricky, you guys. Very, very tricky. Hmm. 
let me think about this for a second. I think I've already decorated, I've already decorated my monthly and my hemlock and oak. I think I'm gonna stick with my horizontal. Um, this is my faith planner. It's from Calva Plan. <clears throat> Let me go to the right page. Hold on. Hold on a second, guys. I'm trying to find the right week that I want to do this for. Um, all right. I got private stuff in here, guys. You can't see it. Private stuff. Okay. So we are going to decorate this horizontal planner. This is from Calva Plan. And I like to keep plenty of writing space available for, oh, now I'm thinking, <sighs> this is one of those sticker books that you want to use right away, but then you don't want to waste stickers either. Oh, boy. Oh, it's so pretty. Excuse me. Oh my gosh, should I just yawn? I'm so sorry, guys. Okay, I am going to... Oh my gosh. I want to see how... Yeah, I mean, that's perfect. That is perfect. Okay, I think... Oh, you guys, I'm conflicted. I have this problem a lot with Cassie sticker books that I, I want to do it in the right planner. <laughs> that Because some of my planners I keep and some of them I just recycle at the end of the year or like when they're done. And her stickers are so pretty that I want them to go into a planner that I'm pretty confident I'm keeping long term oh man I'm conflicted here super conflicted I'm going to go for it I'm going to pull out this sticker sheet which could be a bad idea the other thing I could do is just I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna pull it out. I'm going to cut this out because I don't wanna mess with the integrity of the sticker book. So I'm going to cut this out. Hope I don't regret it. And it makes me a little nervous. Like if I don't use it all, I'll just have to maybe tape it back in with some washi tape. Okay. <laughs> We did that. We definitely did that. That happened. Okay. So I need to have plenty of writing space here. Let me make sure you guys can see me all right. All right. I need to have plenty of writing space. And I'm going to need to date this guy as well. So I'm thinking that... Uh, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, guys, sorry. I should have thought through this a little bit better. I feel like I want some pretty script writing. I've been using this washi a lot lately. Sad will be the day that I run out of this washi tape. <laughs> okay, so let's... It'll be a very sad day. Let's, let's just do it. Oh my gosh, I think I just need to rock and roll. I'm going to grab this washi and 
rip off the sides because, you know, I'm a creature of habit, you guys. I am a creature of habit. I'm going to throw this down here. I know, I know, that looks a little weird. Bear with me. And I'm going to rip some of this. And throw it down on top of the washi. It's gonna hide the dates, but that's okay. This is something I do quite a bit. I just like the vibes, makes me happy. So if you're looking at this and going, Elizabeth, been there, seen that, I'll just say, I know you guys. If you find something that is working for you, then do it. Do it on purpose. Or as Josh likes to quote all the time, do it and let the English see you do it. I don't know what accent that was, but it was supposed to be um, Mel Gibson in Braveheart. Do it and let the English see, see you do it. <clears throat> he tells me that all the time. Okay, so I'm sticking it out a little bit because I want it to pop out from underneath the paper sticker. So while she's going down, And then we're gonna take another piece, and I think I'm going to go from, now that we have that raw edge, I think I wanna go from this side. No, this side. So depending on how you rip this, you're gonna get a white edge. And I like the white edge, but since I didn't have it on the other side, I'm gonna try to avoid it. See how that's basically the paper edge? And now this stuff is the white. I like the white, but I didn't get it on this side. So I'm not gonna do that over here. Okay, so I'm going to Throw this guy down here and I want to soften that edge a little bit just a little bit I love this because ripped paper is my jam ripped washi is my jam so to give me some sheets that I can play around with myself is really awesome and I think I don't want a straight edge so just rip that are we all confused yet <clears throat> or bored because we've seen we've seen me do this layering script washi with yeah that looks nice with um stickers and additional like script washi with grid and other washi sticker situations okay so we are going to go with the this deco vibe because it goes so well with um with that ripped paper and i think oh that's really pretty do i want to stick with i think i'm going to stick with paper stickers today normally i'm a clear person but we're gonna go with oh how much of this do we have though we don't have a lot, so I can't can't go too hard with this stuff. Only one paper of this like garland. So I'm gonna go. Do I wanna go all the way? No. Hold on, let's see if I can pull this guy back up. Hold on a second. I wonder if I should do 
something like this. And then have the garland above it. I'm not sure. I'm gonna go up high. Do we wanna cut off the clock? I don't know. Sure, I think we're gonna cut off the clock. That is definitely crooked though, and I think it's too late. Oh no, it's okay. We're gonna just go with it. That is definitely crooked. Oh man, that's annoying. Could I hide it somehow? By like putting this down? Sort of? Does that kind of correct it? Or did I make it worse? I don't know, guys. I don't know what we're doing. This sticker book is so pretty, it kind of threw me off. <laughs> Kind of threw me off, threw my plans off. So I'm not really sure. We're gonna set this piece aside because I don't know what to do with it. Uh, I think we need <clears throat> a quote and uh, I'm gonna do that it's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Where are my tweezers? Y'all, I feel like this is a hot, here we go. Hot mess of a video today. I apologize. If I, how can I save that? It's so crooked, you guys. It is so crooked. If I put this straight, will that help or will it make it look? Or will it make it look more? I can't tell, did that make it look worse? <laughs> I can't tell, it might've made it worse. All right, I do feel like I need some more shrubbery. Um, up in the corner or maybe I can just do like a star or something would that be weird I feel like I need something up here I guess the dates putting uh, December up here would would help that I don't know I'm conflicted what I'm not conflicted about though is <sighs> that we're gonna need some dating. And the dates, I kinda wanna put here, but I think it would look weird if I added more plaid. So I'm not gonna do that. Let's grab a date sticker book, or we could just use my big old Happy Planner numbers personal favorite of mine. Let's grab Date It 2.0. And we've got big numbers here. So um, these could work. Let's go with the big numbers. We're going to go for it. And I think this means I'll stick with the Date. I was going to date over on this side, but I think we'll stick with, with that. So I'm going to go kind of far, like further over than what was previously printed and go down at the bottom since we need to make some room for that guy. And I'm trying to see through the lines. I think that's there. Yeah, that works. Following the line, go there. It will always come together. And if it doesn't, there's always turning the page to tomorrow. Seven. I can't believe it's almost Christmas. It's unbelievable, you guys. 
eight, nine, and 10. I love a big number. It just, I don't know, makes me happy. Okay, so we've done that. Let me grab a December sticker and that would be this font but I kind of want it to be bigger there we go so hopefully this stacked December sticker will fill in that upper corner where I've got a gap yep just like that. That works. Let's get all of these guys pushed down. And then I have to see what other decorative elements do I want to add. This is my journal. So like my faith journal. And I do um, a devotional. I'm reading through a devotional. And so this is where I kind of write down my reflections. So I like to have plenty of writing but I also like it to look pretty. So I think I've got, I've got some room. I can add some more decor down in this corner. This is super open. I might add um, maybe a pre-made cluster. This is where these clusters are so great because they're already set. So if you're short on time, although this one's a little too big, let's put this guy back. Um, let's see if this one will fit. I just love that she gives us the option to make our own or to use kind of a pre-existing cluster. So we will do that. And then let's go over here. Oh, we do have some paper greenery. Ooh, I wanna use that. Okay, let me think. What, I think I want more, yeah, more deco type stuff. Ooh, like this fireplace is really pretty. Maybe I do this fireplace. Should I throw this in the corner? That's gonna take up a lot of space though. A little bit too much, too much for me. I could take a little bit more of this paper or I think I'd rather take this sprig actually. I take this sprig. No. <laughs> you guys. I am a hot mess. Ugh, put me out of my misery. I'm going to use this guy. Although he's got a flat edge where I don't love a flat edge. It would have to be more like this. Hmm. And then... I could go back through with, I don't really have any presents. That's a lot of green though. What if we did like that guy and that guy? Just adding a variety of different little things sitting on this ledge. That guy. Should we do a snow globe, perhaps? I do like this plant. What if we did? Now we're really running out of space if I go that big at the end. I like one of these wood stars. 
just layer that there. You know, just a little something in the corner. <clears throat> Excuse me. Make sure this gets turned off. <clears throat> I'm sorry, guys. I know this plan with me has been a little sloppy, but I am just kind of befuddled by this sticker book and I'm picturing it in my personal journal. And so I want to make sure I don't uh, use the stickers I'd want to use in my personal journal. All right, let's set this aside and see how are we doing. I know it's not very complex and we have a lot of open space, but like all the other times I decorate um, this devotional journal, this, this quiet time journal, um, I want to leave it open. I want to leave it open so I can um, have plenty of space to write. So I don't want to... I could get more interesting with where I write. Like instead of... I've been doing it really traditional where I just write here. I could start adding boxes where I actually write inside the boxes. But I'm just like not there yet. I could try it this week. But I'm just not sure I'm ready. So, although there are vertical boxes in here, and then there is this one that is so pretty. Oh no. Oh no, you guys. Do I? Dare I? Hold on a second. Hold on. Do I write in boxes in my journal this week? And just plop this down? Oh, 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 oh. It's gonna commit me without me being ready to commit. This is tricky. I'm kind of tempted to lay it down. Oh my gosh, I did it. Oh, it scares me. It scares me greatly. But you know what? It's just paper, right? I was gonna write here anyways. Oh, it's just so much structure. Oh, it makes me nervous. Do I add something here? Oh, I think I should. Just for the sake of balance now. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna add this pre-made one. Oh my gosh, I'm so nervous. I'm gonna do it. I'm actually gonna add this pre-made one right here. Ooh, I did it. Oh, stressing me out. The last thing I'm going to do is add the days of the week just because I think it needs it needs them. And then we're going to call it good. Oh my gosh, you guys. I don't know. I think this would have looked better here, but I had already laid it down. And I don't feel like breaking out the undo. So we're not going to undo. Now I want to make sure we use the same font type. This is the Date It 2.0, by the way. Mojo Jojo Plants, Joyful Tent to save a 10% off your purchase if you decide to pick one up. Let's find the days of the week. Where are the days of the week? Here they are. I think we should do the stacked ones since we did the stacked December. What do you guys think? I think that's a good idea. So, those are paper. Where are the clear? There we go. And I'm gonna keep it kind of lined up with the number. Of course, lined up from the bottom is the better way to say it. 
Tuesday. Is it just me? Or can you guys also see that dating your journal, dating your planner really like moves it to the next level? Doesn't this look like more cohesive? It kind of fills in, breaks up that green a little bit. It always comes together. And this is one of the reasons why I love decorative dating. I don't do a lot of clusters. I do a lot of decorative dating. It's my jam. All right, so we need Friday, Saturday, Sunday. We'll pop this back in the planner and call it a video. You guys, if you have not tried Casthetic Plans, and you are new to decorative planning or um, you like more of that like boho neutral aesthetic, I'm telling you, you will like these sticker books. I really think so. They are just lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. All right, let's flatten this guy I'm using my bone press the clear sticker into the paper and let's see what this looks like on discs which I am thinking <clears throat> I might change out the discs and cover on this guy soon I'm ready for a different color and I do have my um, snapping color cover from Calvo Plan in that really beautiful green color. So I might do that. All right, guys, we're done after a wonky sticker placement and lots of paper rippage. We have my journal for the week. Plenty of space for writing. Don't even ask me how this cluster is going to work for journaling, but I'll figure it out. And all using the Wintertime sticker book from Casthetic Plans. Again, this releases on Monday. Uh, and I think you're going to be watching this video on a Sunday, which means this sticker book, if you're watching this, uh, if you're watching this video right when it released, this sticker book is available tomorrow. Monday, December 4th, 10 a.m. Central Time. This is a 50 sheet sticker book, so it's going to be $34. And if this was helpful, if you enjoy uh, my flip throughs and it helps you with your shopping decisions, I hope that you will please consider um, shopping with my affiliate link down in the description box. All right, friends, come hang out with me over on Instagram. My handle is ejjoyful underscore plans. It is always a good time and you will definitely be seeing some of these stickers in a reel real soon because... Um, yeah, I think I want to use, I really want to use this. So make sure you're following me over on Instagram. I do a lot of uh, speedy plan with me's in my Hemlock and Oak planner over there. And that's where I use some of these um, small shop stickers. So uh, I think that's it, guys. God bless you. God bless you and keep you. Do something creative today. And... I'll see you by next video. Bye.